السلام علیکم و رحمت اللہ و برکاتہ بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم We present to you lesson number 1089 of our daily nasiha and advice. We continue with the Mubarak miracles of Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. This is part 5 of our series. Abu Huraira radiallahu ta'ala reports, One day I invited my mother towards Islam. She was a non-Muslim. And I told her she must become Muslim. She told me such words and I became livid and very, very angry. And I was crying. I came to Mustafa sallallahu crying out of sadness. How could my mother use these type of words for Mustafa Habibuna sallallahu alayhi I said, Ya Rasul Allah, Udullah, Ay Yahdiya Umma Abi Huraira, You are Rahmatul Alameen Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Make Dua For the mother of Abu Huraira Allah Ta'ala gives a hidayat Faqal Mustafa Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Make Dua Allahum Mahdi Umma Abi Huraira Ya Allah give guidance to the mother of Abu Huraira Fakharaj to Mustabshira I ran quickly with the glad tidings Bida'wat in Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam made dua for my mother falamma sirtu ila al-bab when I reached the door of our house fa idha huwa mujaf it was closed fa samitu ummi khashfa qadami and my mother heard my footsteps fa qalat makanaka ya abu hurairah stay outside don't come inside and wa samitu that I heard khadafa al-ma that I heard the drops of the water that now dropping and the water falling and so forth, meaning she was taking a bath. Fagatasalat and she took a bath. Falabisa dir aha, she wore her dress and everything. Wa ajalat min khimariha and quickly she put on, you know, like a scarf and all this type of thing. So meaning that she didn't wear it properly, like you know, some hair and all it was showing. Fafatah fafatah dir bab, she opened the door. So imagine that she embraced Islam and she's covering her body and half covered her hair quickly for her son. Summa qala ya Abu Huraira, Ashadu Allah ilaha illallah wa ashadu anna Muhammad abdu rasulu. There she declared the faith and subhanallah Abu Huraira is now elated, excited. Farajatu ila Rasulillah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. I returned to Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam crying again out of happiness wa ana abaki min al-farah. فحمد الله وقال خير مصطفى صلى الله عليه وسلم praise Allah and he said good words when you study this whole hadith Abu Huraira radiallahu anhu knew that Mustafa صلى الله عليه وسلم is happy he said ya Rasul Allah when my name comes then let the person have special affinity with me therefore when we read a hadith an Abi Huraira radiallahu anhu قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم we have the special love for Sabi Sayyid Abu Huraira radiallahu anhu Nevertheless, Abu Huraira radiallahu anhu, this hadith of the mother of Sayyidina Abu Huraira is authentic mentioned in Sahih Muslim. Sayyidina Abu Huraira radiallahu anhu reported 5,374 ahadith through the different chains of narration. He states, Inna kum taqulun, you'll say, Aksara Abu Huraira in Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Abu Huraira is narrating so many hadith from Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Wallahu al-Mawid, Allah Ta'ala knows the time, the place, everything. Wa inna ikhwati min al-Muhajireen. The Muhajireen brothers who migrated from Makkah to Medina, kana yajhuluhum as-safq. Bil aswaq, they were busy making deals and transactions there in the market, in the bazaar. Wa inna ikhwati min al-Ansar. Kana yajhuluhum amalu amwalihim. They were farmers, the Ansar. So they were the people, remember, that they were so busy, that they were all busy وَكُنْتُ مُرَانْ مِسْكِينَ I was a poor person, no wife, no children. أَلْزَمُ رَسُولَ اللَّهِ صَلَّى اللَّهِ صَلَّى اللَّهِ صَلَّى اللَّهِ صَلَّى اللَّهِ صَلَّى اللَّهِ صَلَّى اللَّهِ I would have one meal a day, little bit food, fill my stomach, and then I would learn hadith, by heart hadith. One day, قَالَ النَّبِيُّ صَلَّى اللَّهِ 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 حتى أقضي مقالتي هذه تل I finish my speech speech here ثم يجمعه إلى صدره and then he takes his shawl and puts it against his chest فينسى من مقالتي شيئا أبدا and he forgets anything will not happen so take your shawl and I'll pray and then you apply it there put it by your chest 
So I, for Basad to Nimritan, so I took my shawl and I placed it. It was a shawl that had stripes on it, Namira. Laysa alayya thawbun ghayruha. Nobody else's shawl was there, only mine. Hatta qadhan nabiyyu sallallahu alayhi wa sallam qalatahu. Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam finishes his khutbah, his lecture, his nasiha advice. Thumma jama'atuhu ila jama'atuhu ila sadri. Then I placed it against my chest and my bosom. Abu Huraira goes on and says, فَوَالَّذِي بَعَثَهُ بِالْحَقِّ Qasam of the being who sent Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam the truth, مَا نَسِيتُ مِنْ مَقَالَتِ ذَلِكَ إِلَى يَوْمِ هَذَا I did not forget anything which Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam taught. So it means Allah Ta'ala blessed him with such a retentive, powerful memory. So may all Matthi Allah Jalla wa Allah grant us such memories that we can remember more and more of the Quran Sharif and the Ahadith Mubarakah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.